Well, I tried to get this thing going and uh, with the music, and I couldn't. So, hello. Um, hey, Anne. Shall I get rid of this uh, crazy effect? I think I should. All right. Oh, Lordy. I, uh, hey! Hey, Jessica! I've got something for you at the end of this. Uh, Jessica, just remind me. Uh, let me get out of here. <laughs> oh, man. I miss, uh, I miss when we had the music in here, and I just can't get Facebook to make that work. Oh, that was, that was kind of, that was off. All right, let's, uh, let's get back. Uh, and there we go. Hey, Brandon. Ah, it's great to be back. I'm back. Uh, let me see if I can make this a little lower. All right. There we go. Mm hmm Lighting. I've got a ring light. You guys uh, have ring lights? I don't know. They're supposed to be good. Here, let me close this uh, shade over here. So, uh, I've got some co-pilots, I think. I think they're going to be coming. But, you know, what do I know? They say they're coming, they're, they don't... Yeah. Hey, Anne, how was, your, uh, how was your thing? I think it was a Wednesday at the KGB Lounge, and Lewinson had a reading. I couldn't make it. I, I had another obligation. But uh, I hope it went well. Um, uh, nice. How, how are people doing... It's uh, it's still rather uh, rather wacky out there in the world. Mm -hmm. There we go. Get a little more of the piano. Oh boy. Um, I got my booster. Fun. Wow. <laughs> A Charles Manson coloring book. Uh, we were just talking about Chuck Manson just the other day. Hey, Margo. Ah, oh, that's so great. Hello. Tim! Ah, oh, I'll let a few people come in before I start playing. Oh, nice. Thank you for that link. Um, I don't know. What have I been doing? I've been very busy, actually, um, because I'm mostly doing outdoor gigs. I'm not gigging a lot, so I'm writing. I'm like, uh, I'm, I don't know. What am I doing? I'm uh, greeting. Tim, are you on the West Coast still, or are you back? Have you been back? Um, I don't know if you can hear... My voice sounds kind of boomy because there's a drum set in the room and the snare's turned off, but it's still like, boom. It, there's still a weird, I don't know. It's just me. Never mind. Uh, what have you all been listening to? Oh, man. You're back. Good. Um, oh, thank you, Jessica. I hope that you, uh, I hope you're enjoying it. Um, yeah, the record is, I think the record is doing pretty well, and, um, I've got a few, uh, celebrities, um, that are, uh, going to listen to it and see if they can write in little blurbs. If anybody else out there knows some celebrities, 
Um, they can ask their celebrity people to write a blurb about my record. That would be nice. I don't know. You know, what's it all about, Alfie? Number one with a poem. <laughs> uh, mm. So I, I've been listening to, uh, lately, incredible blues music. And I started with this record, I think it was like 1969 or so, 68, 69, uh, and it was a band, and then they'd have guests, and the guests were Walter Horton, harmonica, and um, Otis Spann on piano, Willie Dixon on bass, you know, like just on a couple tracks here and there, Buddy guy on guitar. I mean, like, really serious blues guys. And I think it was produced by Chess Records in Chicago. And who is it? Fleetwood Mac. So I have discovered that really early Fleetwood Mac with Peter Green was an incredible blues band. I, so I've just been listening to it. Oh, I'm so glad you like Rinse Cycle. Damn! Thank you! Ah. I'm, uh... I don't know. Is that... Am I supposed to be cool about it? Oh, I'm so glad you like it. I'm not cool about it. I love when people, uh... Uh... Like my... Stuff. <laughs> ah, I live for the praise. But, uh... It's not the praise. I it's because I I really I kind of even don't care about the praise, even if somebody doesn't if somebody doesn't like it. I don't feel bad, um, but I love uh, when people like it because I feel connected. Um, couple songs from the '60s through the '80s. Love it. Bare trees. Oh, the Fleetwood Mac record. Yeah, yeah. I I haven't heard that yet. It's up next. Hello, Nancy. I hope you're well. Oh, so great. All these people here. I said that I had an announcement about blue. Oh, yeah, yeah. I don't think I'm allowed to s talk about that yet. Um, and, it, oh, well, things have been, you know, postponed. Hello. But uh, I will. I will have an announcement. I, I can't say it yet. Anyways, um, well, I guess I can start playing. But, uh, yeah, the early Fleetwood Mac, holy moly, that was a shocker to me. Um, I mean, just, it was so good to my ears. Such good blues. Um, yeah, it's wild to think that it, you know, it took, like, uh, these like British white kids to introduce uh, white America to black America. I mean, that's just how historically, that's how, that's how the blues uh, just like exploded in this country through bands like uh, uh, I guess, like Fleetwood Mac, but also, you know, the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, uh, all those early bands that... And also introduced us to people like Buddy Holly, who we, who we didn't really know yet. Anyways, here we go. Here's a tune. Oh, I hear people. Hold on. Who's here? It's Maura. <laughs> Say hello, honey. A lot of people are here. We have Anne Lewinson, Tim, Brandon, Jessica. Happy Halloween, uh, everybody. Oh, yeah. Happy Halloween. Nancy Adentovich. Ah. Um, who else is here? Uh, Margo Mindich, I, th I believe. I hope she's still here. Ah. And, um, yeah, we have, we have a, a bunch of... Uh, it's a great group. Awesome. But you've been entertaining them all. Well, I've been talking. All right, here we go. Here we go. 
Have you played anything? No, I'm just about to play. Oh, God, you haven't played anything? I was waiting for you. Oh, come on. Is Sothi here? Yes. Sothi, come on up! All right, here I go. First tune goes something like this. Always getting away with murder every day. He loves to play the game. He pretends he's on a mission to paint the world red, but he just wants you to know his name. Robert is the smartest guy in the room. He never met one, could get one past him. He knows he's got the patience of a redwood. Ain't nobody can outlast him. They've got different ways of listening. She finds the truth under the rubble Airing the crimes of the powers that be to the world Or maybe just to her bubble Sean is so sure of his place in the ratings He thinks of the truth like kind of a clay thing People are floored by his sense of conviction Meanwhile the world is just his plaything They've got different ways of looking at the world They're never Those are Dallas Cowboy stars, and I'm guessing it's Jessica. Am I right? I was blue. Yeah, I think I'm right, because there they are. Wow, Cowboys fanatics, those Lafreys. Jessica says that you said you had an announcement about Blue's Clues. Did you tell them that you were... No, no, did you? I am not allowed yet. Oh. I'll wait till... Nancy Asnatovich clap is clapping. Mm. Thank you. It's Jim. <laughs> it's Jim with the Dallas Cowboys. Ah. 
So does Jessica, is Jessica not so much a Dallas Cowboy? Listen, Jim, we have a question. What is it about New Jersey and the Dallas Cowboys? Yeah. Yeah, we notice New Jersey, I mean, my brother, like every, everybody that I know that's a football fan in New Jersey loves the Dallas Cowboys. And when I was growing up in New Jersey, uh, we all loved Southern Rock. What's the deal? How does that happen? Jessica hates football. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's fun to play. Uh, flag football. Touch football. Yeah, that's those are fun. Eric, what is up? Speaking of New Jersey, guy that I grew up with. Because we hate because we the hate Giants. the Giants. All right, but. I have a soft spot for the Phil Simms Giants, the Giants of uh, Refrigerator Perry. <laughs> but that's pretty much it. That, that, is, uh, that was the beginning and the end of the Giants for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm not, you know, yeah. Mm. Okay, let's talk more music. Mm. Well, you heard it, you heard it from, hey, hey. Hey, Lyle. All right, all right, let's move on. I hope uh, not these giants. Yeah, so true. Uh, all right. I hope you dig country music. Here we go. The day after Valentine's Last night we stayed home Leftovers and TV The couch and our phones
Sat Nam, baby! Guru Prasad Singh is here. Mm. Matthew, hello. Rini, Rini is here. Oh, nice. Got a lot of Jersey people. Ah, uh, thank you, thank you. Really enjoyed seeing your videos on YouTube from the CD release party, says Jim. Oh, thanks, Jim. Yes. It was uh, such a nice party. Yeah, it was. Uh, mm. I'm going to start to get some gigs again. Um, I've been skittish, but now I got my booster. People in the city are, you know, it's, it's getting, I feel safer. I don't know. Anyways, yeah. Um, what was it? What else do I, I have? Some oh, I have a I have a fun thing coming on to my website, Christmas related. So maybe I'll wait a little bit. I stopped over at Mariana's house because where I went was near Mariana. So she's, she's on. She's here, and she says, "Nice to see and hear you there, Mr. Nick." Hello. Mariana might go to Portugal. Portugal? Yeah, that's on my list. Uh, stay for six months and then you can get a uh, citizenship. No. No? What is it? Five years, close. Five years? Whatever. <laughs> well, don't stay for five years. I love Christmas too, Jessica. Steve! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Even, uh, even I love Christmas and, uh, you know, I'm a you. But the thing about being Jewish is um, Christmas is basically a paganic uh, holiday, so, uh, you know. Playing in the church really gave you a great reverb sound, Jen says. Yeah, thank you, you did. It, it's, uh, that was, you know, a real big thinking of going to Pittsburgh. Ah, do it, Steve. Great town. Um, from Davis to Pittsburgh, what do you the mean Steve by Culberson this story. Do you mean it's just not religious anymore? No, no, it was never. I mean, Christmas was always an uh, a Christian adaptation of the winter solstice, just like an Easter, also pagan. Sorry, sorry, Halloween, pagan. What about the birth of our Saint Valentine? Pagan. The birth of your Lord Jesus. Yes. Uh, it's nice. It's 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 not his birthday, but uh, sure, you okay. know. All right, I see what you're saying. Okay. Um, whatever. I mean, why not? It's it's not. Birthdays are great. I love them. But you know, Christmas is really it's about the Christmas spirit, whatever that is. And I feel like that's you know that's not really. Brandon something... also likes Hanukkah too. Hanukkah is a little on the boring side, Brandon. Mm. But that's nice of you to say. You know, I I, I, uh, I think i got to get some tickets to see Yola Tango uh, for the eight days of Hanukkah they do at the Bowery Ballroom every year. Honey, tell the Yola so Tango great. story. I love that story. The Yola Tango story? Yeah. Seth can tell it better. I'm not, you know, I'm not... It's very simple. It has to do with the 1971 Mets. Oh, God, no. 60, 62... No. Yes. It's right when they've started. Tim's here. Tim! Thank you, Maura. Um, well, anyway. Okay. Yeah, I no. Okay. So heard a great know. joke. We heard a great joke that I really can't tell. It's not a great joke. Oh, that joke. Yeah. yeah. Woo! Can't tell. No. Can't tell it. Mm. All right. Let's talk. All right, yeah. If anybody has some great jokes, especially great jokes that they can't tell, um, send them to me separately. I love great jokes that you can't really tell. Um, let's see, here's, here's a... Tina says, good to know the party's on YouTube. I'll check it out. But it, it's just a few songs. Jo two songs were the only ones that I could... <laughs> what? Jim just said, less talk, more not. Thank you, Jim. <laughs> God, I have people that get me and understand me. They're on my side. <sighs> but 
It's tough. It's tough that, you know, nothing, happy wife, happy life, and nothing rhymes with husband. And there's nothing, uh, there's nothing we can do about that, Jim, you and me. But uh, it's all right. We're men. We can take it. Here we go. Here's a new one. Um, Tina! Oh, no! Taking off. Yeah, Don't take she off. Probably has to go someplace. Oh, no, no. Don't take off. Um, here's a, here's a relatively new one. In, uh, it's true. It all mapped onto the Romans who mapped onto the Greeks. Yeah. The, uh, the pagan holiday. But, alright. It's alright. Look, there's nothing wrong with that. I'm also on Morris' side, too, says Brandon. Brandon yes. Oh, yes. Thank you, Brandon. And I am, too. We're all and, on Morris' so side. Is Jim. And even when it's against me, I'm on Morris' side. <laughs> and, I was just kidding, and I know it. Yeah, all right, let's talk more. Here we go.
I know. I'm sorry, my phone died. I'm getting a charger. Her phone died. Eradicate. Eradicate. Let's call the whole thing off. That's right. <laughs> Eradicate your hate. Well, yeah. Yeah, you could. I guess you could do that. Oh, <laughs> uh, thank you, Jessica. Mm. That's one of the, uh, oh, is there a free plug in that? Because um, if not, you got to be careful. Don't unplug that one. That's. What about this one? Oh, wait a minute. What wait about a... this one? Uh, wait, I don't. Which one can I unplug? Let's see what they go to. This one goes to the ring light. This one, okay, on this one, this one. Okay. Yeah. <sighs> oh, you just unplugged the ring light. I did not. You somehow did. Well. It's very delicate. It's the big one, the big one. I didn't do anything. Push it, push it in there. You, it has to go up there. Honey. Ah. Anyways, oh, Rini, you missed a good one. You missed the gospel one. It's all right. It'll happen, you know, again sometime. Here's another one, another new one, just wrote. Ah, oh, God. Moore hasn't heard this one either. What can I tell you? Ooh. Um... Oh, man. There's a lot going on. I'm, uh, I, I go to uh, my buddy Walter, J. Walter Hawks, the great trombone player, ukuleleist, uh, singer, keyboard player. Now that I think about it, he's, uh, he's hateful. And he, he makes his own synthesizers and stuff like that. And, and he's also a great chef. Great chef. And, most important, he's a great guy. He's a great guy. One of my favorite people. And uh, we've been getting together and, uh, and making, uh, we're making some. It's probably going to be a thing. It's exciting. <laughs> All right. Anyway, we're making a, a baby. <laughs> and I'm, uh, well, I'll, I'll talk about that later. Here, let's do this. Here's a new one. Better to love than give 
a shrug and just get by Why would I make your burden such a heavy load You are my family my buddy on the road I'll always be there Connected, my friend, through foul and fair, with you till the end. Why would I ever do you wrong? It's a little premature, but um, Steve Miller's here. Steve, Steve. He was here. Ah, uh, oh well. I don't know if he still is. He might be. He said he was taking a shower. Hmm. Well, I'm taking a shower. You're welcome. Wow. I, well, I don't know how to feel about that. Uh, uh, hmm. Uh, if he drops the soap, that's. Uh, I just, uh, there's no, there's no, there's nothing to say. Here we go, let me just, yeah, da, 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 da. Oh, yeah, that's a, for you, that's a relatively calm shirt. It is, it is relatively calm, but it's interesting for, uh, you know, so late in the season. Oh, come on now. Well, that's, I tend to say this is a family show. And Brandon said, sure. <laughs> and John just said, well sung from sing. Oh, thank you. There we and go. Brandon says, you have time? Well, that's the thing, Brandon. It's usually time for me to do one by somebody else, which is um, what I'm about to do. But it happens to be a uke tune, so I'm going to do it on the uke. I mean, it's not originally a uke tune. It's just one I think will sound better on you than on the piano. Oh, Margo, so nice to run into you today. Oh. I'll be back. First time I'm hearing you play. Oh, it's great. I'm, I'm so happy you're here, Margo. Um, we miss you. Yeah. I don't know how this thing works. Jim says, 
Well, it's not exactly why. I know Maura used to give me a hard time about that. I gave up, Jim. I advise you to give up. Ha! I'm a, you know, I'm a fashion uh, revolutionary. Michael Jackson started wearing white socks. I was like, yeah. opened up my world. All right, here we go, here we go. Come on now. Man, there's nothing sadder than trying to tune a uke. I'm sorry. I'll, I'll, here, I'll just stop. <laughs> it can't be done. Yeah, I don't think any of us are going to notice if it's out of tune. Well, I notice and then it, it's distracting. Just, Lisa says hi. Jessica says her mom says hi. She Ah, oh, excellent. <laughs> and Renee and says Renee, you're a fashionista. Uh, thank you, Rainey. Oh, so glad I have some friends all, all the time. I have somebody who will back me up. <sighs> Anyways, um, so uh, this next one is, all right, so, you know, here's a Grateful Dead tune. Um, I started playing with a, uh, uh, a Grateful Dead tribute band again. I had, for years, played in a band called August West. They were great, but for whatever reasons, they uh, diffused. And now, um, and now it's starting up again, a different band, uh, with the leader from that band. And, um, and it's going really great in rehearsal. We're, we're going to be uh, playing a bunch of great gigs all over the place. And... Um, Ah, uh, thank you, Jessica. We are always here for you, even if even if Mora attacks me, which is oh, the, stop all right. She's not attacking me. Uh, anyways, uh, so this one is uh kind of unusual in that um, very few people play this one because um, I'm not sure why, but. It's not a Jerry Garcia, Robert Hunter one. It's a, it's a Bob Weir, uh, Barlow one. But, uh, um, so, you know, those uh, are usually not as good, but this one is really good. Anyway, and uh, there's one chord in it that I have a really hard time playing. There it is. All right, I'll try it. Here it comes. I have seen where the wolf has slept by the silver stream. I can tell by the mark he Sorry, I gotta start again because I forgot the mic. I forgot the microphone. Honey, where were you? What is that? I mean, I don't need you to sing into the mic to hear you, honey. No, I know, but the it helps with the sound on the on the internets. Come on. Wow, why can't oh, here you go. I tightened it too much. Okay. There it is, and I'm back. And it goes like this.
your smile is rolling back Come wash the night time clean Come grow the scorched ground green Blow the horn and tap the tambourine Close the gap in the dark years in between You and me, Cassidy It's quick hearts, uh, quick beats in an icy heart Catch cold, draws a coffin car There he goes and now here she starts, hear her cry It was, uh, yeah. I don't think it's supposed to be uh, quite that. Well, it is. It, uh, most of the dead tunes are much more complicated than uh, they sound, but I make it sound harder. Ah, <laughs> uh, anyways. All right. Here's uh, back to an original. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, thank you, Jessica. Wow, look at all those hands. What is that? Uh, 11, 10, 9. And Lisa's nine. talking to Guru Prasad Singh says, interesting. Interesting. No, I like that one. I like the, uh, I like the words. I like the music. Uh, you should check it out on your own. It's called Cassidy by the Dead. <laughs> and this was just, uh, you know, a way to introduce other people to it. Because uh, uh, I will need to uh, sit with that for a while before I can play it on this thing. I, I play it on piano, but it, it doesn't sound as good as solo. What do you use to keep that thing from catching fire? Right? Thank you, uh, Bob. Bob Douglas. Bob! Yeah, where are you? We miss you. Yeah, come on over. Bring your pet fox. Baba? He has a pet fox? All right, here's a tune. Ah, yes, I told yes. After this tune, I have a tune for Jessica. All right? Tin song Tom Petty on T. Ah, oh, damn it.
Jesse, we know what it is, right? It's the one that she likes the most. As we move on down the road, our shadows taller than our soul. down the road or doesn't that depend on whether we're going towards or away from the sun also do we really know how tall our soul is I don't know I don't know I don't know John I mean Guru Prasad Singh our shadow is taller than our as we move on down the road hmm I think, uh, yeah, let's try that. There we go. And we are back. Hmm? Yeah, this will, this will. I know you didn't make it up. Beatrice, Beatrice Siegel is, is here. Hey. Hello. And Tim knows the precise height of the soul. I can tell you what the precise dimensions of the soul is for a nine and a half, uh, sometimes wide. Does anybody really know what time it is? I don't know, Jim. Does anybody really care? <laughs> oh, boy. I love that one. Whoa, come on now. Mm. Lots of 
jostling up there. I know. All right. Here it comes, the last one, rather high energy. Does anybody really know what time it is? Does anybody really care? Know what time? So I can't imagine why. Y'all have time enough to die. All right, am I back? I think I'm back. Here we go. I was being in kind of scheming, so I served the dirty tea. My heart to pump right through my shirt. I didn't think my trumpet, I knew I wasn't bothered. Just people who believe the lies are swear. But then I saw a scene that was just like all the rest, except that it was you that helped that boy to make a mess. It was you. What if your husband knew? Not long ago, what do the kids know? It was you.
And there it is. And this says goodbye. Aw, oh, thank you, Lisa. Uh, this is not a pet. What's that? This, the fox is not a pet, Bob says. Oh, Bob's fox. Sasha trapped under the shed, but later on, total nightmare. Oh, God. Well, Bob, um, once you have a fox, uh, it doesn't matter where it came from, it's yours. Time for the chicken soup. Oh. With the fox? I guess. There's only one cure for a fox, and it's, Thank it's chicken soup. Thank you so soup. much for playing this, Jessica says. Oh, of course. Thinking of me. Truly appreciate it. Renee says, loved it. Good to see you're back. Encore, Elliot says. Oh, that's nice. Well, there will be more of these. I just, uh, you know, I never know when, but I'll, I'll let people know. And um, in the meantime, pop onto my website when you get a chance. There's plenty of stuff there. More and more stuff. All the time. Um, what else? Tomorrow, uh, I got a gig in Far Rockaway that is so fun. Rowing the Nomads. An eight-piece reggae R&B monster on the beach, outdoors, in Far Rockaway. And uh, if you haven't been to Far Rockaway before, you're in for a treat because they, they're crazy, crazy out there. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's a lot of fun. Am I coming out with shirts? I should come out with shirts. I will talk to my daughter, my uh, artistic director, about shirts. Hmm. Be good to get button-down shirts, you know, not the t-shirts, but like these, but with stuff. I'll talk to her about that. All right. See you later, everybody. I'm going to post this up on the website with all the other ones. There's another one that's missing. I'll, I'll put it up on, on the website and on uh, YouTube. Oh! And if you haven't yet subscribed to my YouTube channel, um... I did. You did! That's right. Maura did. Finally. <laughs> um, but, uh, I, uh, I have a hundred and something. And, uh, if, if you all help me get to two hundred, each hundred I'll put something new on my website. Um, hmm. That's going to be difficult to, uh, but I'll do it. I'll do it. So, uh, yeah, the Lawfreys did. I knew that. You guys did early. You were early adopters. Uh, it's easy. It's easy. Oh, yeah, Bob, come with a saw. And uh, are you a subscriber, Bob? I know, you know, it's, uh, this is all new for people of my age. Uh, to subscribe to a YouTube channel, but it is commitmentless. You just, you say subscribe and then that's it. You never hear from it again and there's no money or anything. It's just, uh... <sighs> the thing is, the YouTube corporation, they put advertisements in front of a bunch of my videos and, um, and for that, the companies that advertise, they they pay money, and the money goes to YouTube. Rob said he, Bob said he is. Thank you. I did. So Thank quit you. Quit your explanations. Yes. <laughs> but, see, uh, I get a little piece of that money that gets advert from the advertising in front of my head. If I get a thousand, I need a thousand subscribers. And you're one-tenth of the way there, honey. Yeah. And some missionaries came to his door when he subscribed. Guru Prasad Singh. Oh, he should have told them to subscribe. And then you could subscribe to them. Well, I think what he's saying is that once he subscribed, missionaries oh, came see. to his door. <laughs> but um, that was special that I sent them. <laughs> all right, everybody. I will see you all later. Happy Halloween. Yes. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.